welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna try and do something different, like makeup and theories. It's more like prediction. And it's still on a stew marker thing. This is my concealer. <laughs> okay, um. I can, s the opening scene for six or seven, um, stew marker trying to split the core four up. Like, I see their parents being the opening kill or attack, or kill in an attack, because Joe would be in New York with Gail. He'll have like one of his cult member attack Joe like during the live show, the girl's live show. And then <clears throat> have another one attacking Martha back in Wordsboro or outside of Wordsboro where they are at. Forcing the transact to separate. Like, cause they're, when they're alone, they're vulnerable. So, yeah. That's an idea that I had for that. And then, I also thought of, um, Stu trying to recruit Sam. I know everybody has that theory. I agree with that theory. Cause it's Billy's daughter. He doesn't want to kill her. Instead of going after Sydney in Scream 6, He's gonna say that for seven. He's gonna go after Sam now, cause that is Billy's daughter, and he, <laughs> and he's gonna want to relive that nineties that duo that he had with Billy. So, do your foot is that? <laughs> yeah. And then maybe like the climax or towards the end. <laughs> this was mentioned on Craven Something Scary uh, Life Theory thing, so I'll leave this link below and you guys can go check it out. And I agree with this, that the, the battle at the end of 6 or 7 would, should be between Stu and Sydney, Stu and Sam, or like Stu is trying to, like Sydney sees Stu trying to recruit Sam, and then Sydney and Tara have to like shoot him or something. <laughs> okay. And then no, then Kirby. <laughs> Sorry this seems like out, out of place. Only French card is French skedaddle. <laughs> sort that later. Okay. Okay, now I have a theory for Kirby. She is now a strength or a therapist. She is Stu's strength class therapist. And he tells her everything because he figures she, because it's the doctor patient confidentiality, she can't say anything to anyone. Yeah, I want Kirby to come in and scream six, seven, this huge secret, knowing that Stu's alive. Ooh, but she doesn't know that it's Stu. Maybe Stu's like, going under a different name but she's working in that facility i like that yeah she's mm -hmm. yeah stew's in witness protection that was mentioned too in the live stream yes he's in witness protection she's his, his, his therapist and he's blackmailing her uh, she's inadvertently his occult member it's like you can't say anything to anyone What I have for Kirby. <laughs> I have like a whole list. I gotta look at my book. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I yeah, I can also see Kirby being the mentor for the core four, like maybe Cindy Causer. Like I can't leave my kids, like my husband has his new job, you know, like they promoted him or something. So, yeah. And yeah. I think I've said this before, but I want some of the parents to be in this little cult thing. So, yeah. Yeah, but in Scream 6, I think 
that um, stitch focus will be to separate the trend and the focus on recruiting Sam to be a part of his little cult thing so he can relive what he had with her dad. I have a couple of other things, but I want to save it for another video. So, yeah. Hold on. <laughs> I'm not scared about this. Oh, maybe I should write that out. And so, those are kind of like the predictions that I have. Yeah, Stu's focus is now on Sam, the Core 4. Instead of just killing them, just try to recruit them. Yeah, separate the trims and recruit Sam. And using Kirby to do so. Because Kirby is around the same age as Sam. Maybe a little bit older. But he can use her to try to convince Sam to be a part of that cult. Because she's a survivor. She can easily relate to Sam and the others. <clears throat> I, I gotta finish makeup. And this is my ideas that I have an apple. <laughs> okay, so like this little video. Comment your theories and ideas. Even if it's far fetched. So who cares? Because <laughs> to me, there are movies are like soap, soap operas. Anything can happen. Anyone can come back from the dead. Regardless if it makes sense or not. Anything can happen. So, yeah, that is me. So, hope you guys like this video, and yeah, see you the next. Thanks for watching this video. Even if you don't agree with my theories or predictions, it's just it's something fun to do. So, yeah, like this video, subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you in my next video.